Mission Impossible 2 Short Mood Review. When a deadly virus and its only known antidote are stolen by an ex-spy who's a moron and doesn't behave like a spy at all, Ethan Hunt has to send a newly recruited thief who he's just had sex with for no other reason than that she's the female lead and they're both risk-taking dumbasses. He assembles a small team and has to try to get the both virus and antidote back. This is really just a John Woo action film with some spy elements shoehorned in and it shows really throughout. The whole film was written around the action scenes that John Woo wanted to do and while those action scenes are quite fun and exciting, it really does let the rest of the film down. The plot doesn't make complete sense, characters are uninteresting and or make strange decisions. The... Yeah, the whole film just really wants to be an action film and it's really only the action scenes that are worth watching. The emotional core is pretty void because we don't care about the relationship between Hunt and the thief Naya because it's not at all developed. They just meet and have sex and then from that we're supposed to care. If you like this review and want a more detailed one, check below. It's there as a video response. If not, it'll be in the description box. I've reviewed other parts of this series. The links are in the description box. Please rate and comment and hey, if you like this video, that subscribe button's just waiting for you to click it.